Hello everyone, welcome to AS Code. In this tutorial, we will learn how to make a CSS text stock. And this text tutorial is about the CSS text stock. As a CSS tutorial series, we have started some days ago. You know that, and now we are going to start this continue this text here. And this is now we are going to make it a CSS text stock in this video here. So you can see I have added a basic HTML and the basic CSS file. I have added my style file here. You can see after this body section, this title I have added is CSS text stock. So I'm going to this this body section here. So here I will open this for this. Here I will add a class name that is title. So here I'm adding this title, and here I will type this CSS and text. And after adding this, and we will clone this text also, or you can clone this line, or you can type this. So here I'm adding this another is. Okay, I have added. Okay, I need to type this class again. Okay, so here I have I want to add a something and I will remove this text. So here I'm adding this stroke. So it's T R O K. So here this is stroke and I will add this class name here. I'm typing also the class name is stroke. So after adding this and now we'll go for this body section. Let's copy this class name body here and after this style file, here I will type this body here and now I will set here this position that is i'm going to select this position is relative because i want to using a break line we can use that a display flex but this break line will not work for this flex item so here i will type this top i'm typing this top is 30 bs and from the left side i will type it that is i'm typing it's 30 percent okay 35 percent that will be better and i will add a background so here i'm adding a background I have type it wrong case so here I will type this background is I'm typing a black colors background so now we can open it and you can see this a plain black color like this so now we'll go to this section again here and now we'll copy this class name and this here so let's go to this class name here so here I'm typing this title class and now we'll set this font size for this item here I'm setting this font size is I'm going to set it 8 frame and after setting this and now I will set this color for this here I'm going to color is transparent and here we will add a this webkit stock here so here I'm going to add a webkit webkit text stroke webkit text stroke here I'm going to add a one pixel and this color will be here I'm going to add this color is FFF so it will be white colors so like this you can see this font size and this space this color transparent so here i will add a another item that is letter spacing here i'm going to add this letter spacing is one pixel for each of the letter it is it will be one pixel space here and here i'm also adding a transition that will be smooth here all of our text so here i'm going to add is 0.4 second so just add it successfully here so now if we check this item you can see like this but we want to make this all item in this text transform is uppercase so let's go to this item here and now we'll add a text transform okay text transform is uppercase so now we'll see this all of this text is capital letter you can see like this now we can increase some font weight for this item so we'll go here and i will say this font weight so here i'm going to font weight is here i'm going to add this 700 so it will be more bloody type like this you can see just like this so now we'll design this niche this blow this stroke here let's go to this and we will copy and paste this full item here and then we will change this value for this item we have a stroke class name here so let's copy this and we will remove this title class here for this section here we will decrease we will increase some font rim because we want to make some exact size like that so after adding this so i think is almost already set here so now let's go to check and you can see like this the css text is stroke and everything is all right here successfully so you can see this we have created this css text is you can see that no visualization and no bloody effect no blur effect and everything is smoothly and working is it is a good looking text you can add this in your website if you have an website or like this so you can see like this type of css text stock here we have created using just a simple code that is webkit text stock 
this is the most important for this text is to color and you can also add a fill color that is we get text fill here we can use this fill color also so this is my my goal is to into this into this thing this video is we want to show you that the text is stuck here so we have shown this text is stuck successfully like this so if you enjoyed this video if you enjoyed this video please like on this video and share it with your friends and please subscribe and thanks for watching this video